Hi, welcome to Adtastic. I'm your host, Tony Stanall, and today we're talking with Christina Inge from Thoughtlight. Welcome, Christina. Hi, Tony. I'm very excited to be here. Now, your field is in um, marketing analytics and and metrics. Uh, What's your background? I I know you've written a book or two. Yes. Um, So I started Thoughtlight, which is a digital agency here in Boston, Massachusetts, that does Uh, primarily online marketing for mission-driven organizations and um, corporate social responsibility, uh, higher ed. And one of the things that I've always been passionate about is making marketing measurable. Every dollar counts. And more to the point, every touch point with your customers counts because consumers don't forget when they have a good or a bad experience. So you want to make sure that you're measuring the impact every touch point your customers have with your brand and making sure it's the best that it can possibly be as well as the most impactful that it can possibly be. So every engagement we do at Thoughtlight has analytics baked right in. We stand behind everything we do and we measure everything we do. And we more importantly, optimize everything we do and you need data to do that. So, um, I have been a passionate advocate for measuring all of your marketing. Part of that is I teach marketing analytics. In fact, I developed the programs um, in marketing analytics in the online professional master's programs, both at Northeastern and Harvard here in the Boston area. Never could find the right book. Um, For my master's students who are all professionals working in the field, everything was too theoretical, too Excel heavy. No knock on the other books, though. So I wrote my own and it's available now. Marketing Analytics, a comprehensive guide from Flat World Publishing, also a Boston um, brand. And what it is, is it walks you through how to do analytics. It's not about crunching numbers in Excel. It's not about the theory of analytics. It's exactly what are the metrics I need to measure and how do I measure them? And um, it just was born out of my own need to do analytics and share that with students, colleagues, employees, and clients. Gotcha. Uh, Christina, do you have any examples in the book or maybe from your experience with Thoughtlight? of uh, how you helped a client, you know, what type of measurable results were the before and after? Oh, absolutely. Uh, One of the ones that always stands out to me is a, uh, it was an old brand with a new project launch need. They were a dinnerware company. Um, I don't know if I can say the name because we keep our clients very uh, their data very confidential, but it's one that you've seen and heard in a lot, seen and heard about in a lot of stores. They were selling through Macy's, Kohl's. Uh, some of their designers were even in Harrods, but they had never sold direct to consumer, and they wanted to do e-commerce and they wanted to go direct to the consumer. And you know, there's this stereotype about you buy your first set of dishes when you're getting a new apartment. That this is a, a young audience that they were catering to, and that people. Um, We're purchasing this product more as like a maybe not a once in a lifetime thing, but a rare thing. Mm -hmm. We went to market with a vague idea of who the customer was, but we had no personas and we had no real segmentation because we did not have that data from our customers. But instead, we found through doing data analytics that, in fact, their target audience was much older and much more frequent shoppers. And so by doing that, we were able to increase their web traffic 13x and have a very strong product launch. We use both offline and online metrics. We use both quantitative and qualitative measures. So focus groups, Facebook ad data, and also email marketing metrics, as well as web analytics And that was an extremely successful case of not just bringing a product to market, but also understanding your segmentation and targeting through analytics. The customer was very happy. Gotcha. Gotcha. Well, who says you can't teach an old brand new tricks, right? Um, You always can. Thanks for joining us. (laughs) Thanks for joining us, Christina.
Thank you, Tony, for having me. And again, Marketing Analytics, a comprehensive guide. There you go. Uh, and thank you for tuning in to another episode of Adtastic. Uh, to find out more about Christina Inge and her book, simply go to dailyadbrief.com. And we'll see you next episode. Simplify presents Addressable CTV, combining the power of TV with the targeting and attribution of digital. Simplify's Addressable CTV delivers massive reach with the ability to scale without sacrificing precision. TV buyers can generate incremental reach with household level targeting, frequency controls, reporting, and insights. To learn more about Simplify's Addressable CTV and what it can do for your clients, visit simply.fi.